Hi folks, welcome back to another Teardown Tuesday. And today we're going to be taking a look at a component that's really common in refrigeration systems, but is commonly misunderstood, and that's a filter dryer. And you can see the one that the filter dryer we've got here has uh, two inlet ports, one outlet port, and the flow direction on here is labeled. You can see there's a, a little arrow on the label. One of those inlet ports would probably be for a service port. The other one would be the liquid line coming off the condenser. So you can see it's got a, a few things on the label here. It's got some basic measurements about the, the body size. And then it's got the, the volume that can flow through on the inlet. And then down at the bottom there, it tells you which refrigerants it's able to work with. So in this case, it can work with HCFC or HFC, uh, which would be our hydrochlorofluorocarbons or hydrofluorocarbons. And it's got some pressure ratings for the maximum working pressure. Remember, this is on the high pressure side, and it can only be fed liquid. So let's get it opened up here. So we're opening the outlet side of the filter dryer. And when we call it a filter dryer, it's because it's doing two separate tasks, but it's doing them in one body. And the, the first part, the filter part, is capturing any physical debris that's floating around inside the system. With refrigerant systems, it, we're either going to have a cap tube or an expansion valve, and, and either one is going to have a very small orifice and a, the, an opening we've got to make sure is clean and clear for that refrigerant to flow through correctly. If we get any kind of physical debris into those, we're going to clog those and, and the system won't cool. It won't flow refrigerant, won't move the right capacity of refrigerant. So this part is just capturing the physical debris that may get in the system. Now. The other part of the dryer, the dryer part, is what we're, what we're pulling out or what we're seeing down underneath here. It's that material right there. And that material is what's called a, a desiccant. And desiccants are designed to absorb moisture. When you install a filter dryer, it's really critical that as soon as you unseal it, you get it in the system because this desiccant will start to absorb moisture from the air as soon as you expose it. So this desiccant block is absorbing moisture from the refrigerant as it flows through, and that moisture absorption prevents components from rusting or oils from contaminating or refrigerants from acidifying. So it's very critical to have in the system. Now, Downstream from the desiccant is this fine fiberglass pad that's covered by a steel screen. And you can see in this particular filter dryer, the desiccant is breaking down and it's clogging the filter. So this one was in service for, for quite a while. It's typical to replace these every time you service a system. So if you have the system open, you put in a new filter dryer. And, and you can see down inside there's really nothing else in this. So we have the desiccant block, we have the fiber filter pad, and the mesh filter pad. It's a pretty straightforward, commonly misunderstood, but that's what a filter dryer looks like inside. All right, I think that'll do it for now. Thanks for watching. Hi, folks. My name is Jack Kell and I'm a senior technical trainer for SmartCare. The video you've just watched is part of a larger series of technical training videos we make available to our technicians at SmartCare. If you found this interesting and you'd like to see more, please subscribe. 
I'll be releasing a new component teardown video every Tuesday in 2022. If you're already a smart care technician and you have a part that you'd like to see me tear down, please reach out to me internally for shipping instructions. If you're not a smart care technician, but you or someone you know would like to learn more about a career as a service technician specializing in commercial restaurant equipment, please check out our open positions at www.smartcaresolutions.com forward slash careers. Thanks for watching.